Organize your drawing by assigning layer objects to layers. When a drawing becomes visually complex, you can hide objects that you currently do not need to use by layers. In this video, we will discuss what is layer and how to create and work with layers in AutoCAD. Using layers gives the drafter total control by organizing the drawing on different layers that are associated with a specific function or purpose. A typical lighting layout consists of a floor plan, lighting symbols, wired connection, switch connection, and the circuit home run. It might be helpful to think of layers as clear plastic sheets that when viewed on top provides us the full detail of a lighting layout of an electrical plan. With layers, you can associate objects by their function or location, display or hide all objects related to a single operation, and enforce line type, color, and other property standards for each layer. Now that you understand what a layer in AutoCAD means, you are now ready to create and define a layer. To see how a drawing is organized, use the layer command to open the layer properties manager. You can either enter L and A in the command window or you can click the Layer Properties tool in the ribbon. In here, you can see the different layers of the sample lighting layout. Notice how you can hide or show, change the color, line weight, and the line type of all objects on a specific layer. To create a layer, click on the new layer icon, rename the layer, and set the default properties such as color, line type, and line weight for that layer. This means that all objects drawn on that layer will have the default properties you set. To delete a layer, select the layer, then click on the delete layer icon. Once you learn how to create layers, learn how to work with layers. Want to set a layer as the current active layer? Or you would want to move an existing object to a different layer? Here's how. In the quick access to layer settings, the current layer is displayed. That means that all of the objects to be drawn will be on that current layer. First, let us draw some figures in here. Note the current layer. If you want to change the current layer, click on the inverted triangle on the current layer.
Then select the layer you wish to be active by clicking it. Now, all objects to be drawn will be on the current active layer you selected. To move existing objects to a different layer, select the objects, then choose the layer where you want those objects to be. Notice how their properties change with respect to the properties of the layer you chose. That's it! Explore other layer options to learn more.